Welcome to Ponder This, brought to you Monday through Friday by Messenger Church, located at 602 Summit Road, Fenton, Missouri. We'd love to have you to come in and enjoy what God is doing in this house. We have church every Sunday morning at 10 a.m. We gather together inviting anyone and everyone to come at six o'clock on Sunday nights for prayer. The word of God in Isaiah said, my house shall be a house of prayer. That's not hard to understand, is it? God wants us to make his house a place to where we pray and not play. All right. We seek his face. We honor him. We respect his house. We honor his presence. And so we invite you to come. Also on Wednesday nights, we have word studies with pastor where I walk you through the word of God at seven o'clock and spend about 45 minutes in that word sharing what God has birthed in my heart. We love to have you. If you want more information about us, you can go to messengerchurch.com. Calm. All right. Also, we do we do stream our Sunday uh, AM service at ten thirty every Sunday morning. So join us for that. All right. Let's get into our seed thought. Well, we'll have uh, something to ponder on for the next little while. It takes time, energy, and effort to prepare and preserve what is good. But for the future of the following generations, we must persevere. Never, I say never give up. The end results will be worth the labor. Now, now what I'm, I'm wanting to target there and what I want you to see there is the extreme need or necessity of living out our life for God of living out our Christianity, all right, as the word of God dictates, all right? It does take energy. It does take preservation. Preserve it is what we must do, but why? Why? For the future, for the generations coming up behind us. Understand something, folks. We are building a foundation for our sons, our daughters, our grandsons, our granddaughters. How we live, how we talk, how we walk, how we act is a, a directive for them, for we are to be the example of godly living, the example of faith. They should be able to look at every one of us and say, hey, that's what I want to do. That's how I want to be. And what I'm, I, I want to get across to you right there, it takes energy. It takes effort to turn your back on the world around about you. It takes energy and effort to seek the face of God above the powers of the enemy. But those that are watching you, they need to see it. They need to hear it. Think about that. Just ponder on it. You are the example for your children. Are you faithful to church? Do they hear you praying? Do they ever see you worshiping and giving glory to God? Good question, isn't it? Think on it. God bless you. Thank you. Ponder this. We'll be back tomorrow to drop some more seed into your heart. If you're enjoying it, why don't you comment for me? And then share what you've heard today, that some of your friends and family that may not follow me, they will and are following you, and they can be blessed by God's word. I love you. And Jesus loves you. Goodbye.